I just realized the scariest thing about being sent here. We don't have Carrie with us. We don't have any of our pixels with us. We don't have Tippy. We don't have any of these guys with us. We don't have Peach or Bowser. We don't have any pixels, especially Carrie. This is literally and utterly hell. <laughs> Anyways, welcome back to Super Paper Mario, guys. My name is Minish May. I messed up my intro again, but that is all swell. Um, in the last episode, a lot happened. We picked up the next pure heart, but um, a world exploded. Dementio fucking murdered us, <laughs> sent us to hell, and now our grand adventure begins anew, I suppose. If you head straight ahead, you'll find Queen Jadies in her palace. But do not get her angry, or you'll end up on the bottomless pit cleanup duty forever. Bottomless pit cleanup duty? Hey, how's your after game? Listen, if you feel tired, take a dip in that fountain. That'll power you right up. Of course, if you're already feeling fine, there's probably no reason to go in for a swim. And as he said, if you stand in here when you're low on health, it'll regenerate for you. Boy, if that micro Goomba hadn't dashed out just as I jumped for that platform. Oh, you swerved in midair, landed on a spiked floor, and then ended your game, huh? What? No, what kind of jumper do you think I am? I cleared the spikes easy. Then BAM! Bottomless pit! <laughs> oh boy, I can tell you're new here. Let me do you a favor and tell you what's up. The river Twigs is up ahead, okay? Be really careful not to drown. Where it is, there are ghosts down there that drag you down, never to surface again. Huh? What happens to the shadies that fall in? Well, they're after game ends. I figure they end up in some post after game or something. That's sketchy as hell. Also, the design for this place, just like all the other places, is amazing. It's so nice. What do we have here? Dooby dooby doo. Oh me. I wonder if I shall meet my most special someone this day. Surely he is a prince of countenance fair, pining even now to meet me. Quickly, my loving prince, fly to me! Ugh. Pray, what call hast thou to stare at me so? Didst thou hear me pine for an old mustachioed fatty? Be gone! <laughs> Fine. Fuck me, I guess. Oh, jeez. Ah! <laughs> Why was that so comedic? <laughs> it like spooked me, but it was like almost in character. I love it. Oh shit, wrong way. Wait, ah! What the? <laughs> it's okay, everything's fine. Fire? Oh my goodness gracious. There we go. Why would they have spikes? Well, actually, I guess it's hell, so it kind of does make sense. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. Can I, like... Oh, we can. Okay. I want you to come over here, sir. Just come over here. No! Hey! Dummy. <laughs> okay, there we go. Come on. Hey! Oh my goodness. This is embarrassing. Okay, I can't even get up there. Well, hopefully we go back to the, uh, the fountain soon. Wait, I can't even get up here? Okay, there we go. Okay, so, um, this is the River Twigs, and as you all know, well, those of you who have been watching the series since the beginning, you all know that this is a replay series from 2011. I had played Super Paper Mario back then, and I just want to show you guys a quick little clip from that, and let me put that in right now. One day, when Mario died... He decided that he was gonna die again by jumping into the river twigs. Well, it's a my time to die, so goodbye, cruel world. I'll miss you. Oh, 
What the hell is up with this music? Oh, I'm gonna have nightmares. As you can see, we are in that same place as that clip that I just showed. So I figure, why not reenact it? Ahem. <clears throat> I gotta. I gotta. <clears throat> okay, here we go. One day, when Mario died, he decided that he was gonna die again by jumping into the river twigs. Well, it's a my to- oh shit. <laughs> well, it's a my time to die. So long, cruel world. I'll miss you. What. The. Hell. Is up with this music? Oh, I'm gonna have nightmares. No, but for real, let me let me be quiet so we can listen to this music because it is fucking terrifying. If this won't give you fucking nightmares, I don't know what will. Cause let me tell you, this shit scared the hell out of me when I first played this game. Those things are called underhands and I can't scan them because we don't have Tippy. But it's terrifying. I think these are supposed to be the ghosts that that one guy was talking about. This is the River Twigs. Its waters are the tears of the centuries of sinners. For four coins, I will ferry you to the other side. Hmm, very well. We don't need anything, we just swam through it. But, in case you couldn't realize, JD's, Hades, Twigs, Sticks, it's all a play on words. And it's really fun. Look, we don't need any, any boat ride. No secrets. Through the door we go. Do do do. Do 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 do. Hello. Hi. How are you? Good. Great. I'm a D man, prime go getter and faithful queen servant. You want to see the queen? You gotta move, kid. Okay. She's real busy. Oh, and here's a tip. She knows all the bad stuff you did before your game ended. So don't play the whole I'm a hero stuff down here. Just warn you, kid. D man. Demon. Ah, so busy. Blah blah. It's like work is in my mouth. I'm choking on it. I swear, I'm so busy I don't have time to think, much less eat or sleep. Blah! Hey, so if you lived a good life, you can move to the over there. I hear it's nice. And I've gotta say, I kinda get a virtuous vibe off of you. I'm sure you'll make it there. You ought to go speak to Queen Jadies right away. Shoot, I'm on dredged patrol for the river twigs tomorrow. That riverbed is huge, too. What a pain. But it's gotta get done. Shadies get stuck in the hole down there. Ooh, that's terrifying. Hello. You, what business have you with me? I am Queen Jadies, mistress of the underwear, ruler of those with ended games. Here in this place, your sins from your time among the living are weighed. If your sins are light enough, the bliss of the over there will be yours. But if not, you suffer for eternity among the game over. Now let us weigh your sins. Hmm? I sense a strange energy. Have you brought something strange into the underwear by any chance? What is this? No, no, it could not be. But how? It is badly damaged, yes. But what you hold is a pure heart. Who exactly are you to have a pure heart? And what has happened to it? Oh, wait, that is my phone. Sorry, I have to take this. What is it now, Grams? You know I am working. What? Love B is missing? Oh, mercy. I understand. Yes, yes. I will see to it. Mm? Bye. Just great. Just what I need. I am already shorthanded. What am I going to do? Oh, perhaps you can help. That phone call I received just now, it was the king of the over there, Granby. One of the Nimbies vanished from the over there, and he asked me to look for her. But I cannot abandon my duties here in the palace, and my D-men are all busy. So it must fall to you. Will you search for the missing person in my place? Yeah. Oh, thank you so very much. I apologize for asking this of you, but it would really help. The name of the missing NIMBY is Lovebee. Oh, and what is your name? Mario. 
Well, Mario, may I hold onto the pure heart while you were busy searching? Oh, uh, th wait, 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 th 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 but that's mine. Worry not, I just want to look. I will return it to- I will return it when you return with Love Bee. And in its place, allow me to give you this. A key to a door located in the underwear. Where it has reached me that someone has fallen into the river twigs. Someone said it was a strange fellow dressed in green. That could not be Love Bee. Still, just in case, I would suggest that you check there first. This key will open the door to the underground waterways beneath river twigs. Please, I must ask that you search the area thoroughly. Welp, it looks like Mr. L has arrived in the underwear with us. Dementio sent him on his way, and now we must go and find the man. Man, so much has happened and we're only ten minutes in. Welp, time to die again. Boy. <laughs> it's so fucking creepy. Why does this game have so many creepy things in it? We got Mimi, we got this, we got a world, like, legit ending. It's creepy as hell. Alright, let's skedaddle on through here. More underhands. <laughs> Get away. Can I go down here? No. Ooh. Can I push this? Wait. Does this just drain the entire river twigs? Is that what we're doing? Can I like jump into this? Nope. Also, I'm gonna take a minute for the uh, the underwear music because it's really, really, really nice. Alright, I'd say that that is a- uh, huh? Wait. Eh. Uh, hello? Is this not what we're supposed to do? Um, hmm. Well, call me confused. If I don't understand and I'm just being dumb, Honestly, that's probably the uh, the reasoning. I'm just dumb. Wait. Wait. Oh. Wait a minute. That's strange. Oh. Mm, not gonna really collect all that. All right, back to the door. Oh, what do we have here? Oh, oh boy, how did I end up in this stinky place? Complex underlings grabbed me. I remember that, and then. And then, oh, forget it, I just wish somebody would come help me. Ah! 
bro. Oh yeah, I missed you, bro. What? Huh? Why am I here? Well, I don't really know. I mean, where am I exactly? What? The underwear? The land of ended games? Bro, what are you saying? What does it all mean? Oh, this is so wholesome, actually. Uh-huh. Okay, I gotcha. So my game is over. Great. I guess one of Count Flex baddies must have done me in, just like you guys, huh? Well, everybody runs out of extra lives sometime, right? So what do we should we do now? Lovebee? You're looking for someone named Lovebee. Well, hey, sounds good to me. I'm loaded with free time. After all, my game's over. Luigi has joined your group. As Luigi, first press and hold down, then release to soar up or with a super jump. The super jump is perfect for reaching high ledges or attacking enemies above you. I was feeling pretty low, bro, but now that you're here, I want to jump for joy. Nice. This looks like a job for Luigi! Of course we get Luigi as soon as our other party members aren't here. But we finally got him! And he's a piece of paper. Can I get healed by being in here? Maybe? Nope, it looks like it's the, uh, the, the fountain. Only the fountain. Alright, let's go and get Love B. I'll meet you guys back at River Twigs. Alright, we're out of River Twigs, the fucking hell hole of hell. And now, now that we have Luigi, we can finally do this fucking trick that I wanted to do. Aha ha! Goodbye! Wait, shit. I remember I love be being over in this direction somewhere. Oh, she was on that pipe that we just jumped to, but... Watch this. Destroyed. Yowch. Destroyed. Ooh, no, I don't want to fight you. Woo! A single coin. I love it. It's so good. Eh, I don't I don't I don't need it. I don't care for it. Is there anything up here? Any secrets? Nope. Through the door! Oh, she's nearby. Oh my god. Uh oh. There she is. Oh, hurry, hasten to me, my sweet prince. Foulness, an aging man of mustache grim returneth. Talk not to me as though we have met. Speak now, what dost thou want from me? Thou come hither to find me? Ha! As if I would consort with a face so be haired. I await a handsome prince, understood? Princes only. Oh, but hold a moment. Ha <laughs> ha! Dost thou claim to be the prince of whom I pine? Priceless, yeah, verily. Very well then, good prince, let us confirm thy lineage. If thou art my prince, then surely thou knowest my name, speak it to mine ears. If thy name is true, then I shall admit thou art mine, one and only. Love thee. Ha <laughs> ha, in thy face, my name is not love- What? <laughs> how, how, how thou come by the knowledge of my name? No, doth this mean? Doth this mean? Am I okay? Nay, nay, such foulness! The very thought cannot be abided! 
I cannot date a man so old and unpleasant to the eye. I shall return to mother. Gag! I thought she was about to show gay! What the hell? Oh my god. That's some funny shit. I'm gonna go back to the... Hui! I'm gonna go back to the fountain. Oh! Oh my god. I'm going back to the fountain to heal. Holy crap. Alright, finally, can we stop with the beeping? Thank god. Alright, I'll meet you guys back at Queen Jady's Palace. I'll see you guys in a second. Alright, here we are, back at Queen Jady's Palace. We have Love B. Or, like, she came running back. Ha! At last thou appearest, foul hairy creatures! Thou art no princess, thou art liars. Thou approachest me on my mother's behalf. Love me, mind your manners. You know this all happened because you wandered off without permission. Now, apologize to these nice men at once. Um, yeah. So, um, yeah, I am sorry that thou were so hairy. <laughs> oh, love me, you had us all so very worried. Mario, please accept this as a sign of my eternal thanks. Here. Nice. You got the revitalized pure heart. I have power over life and death, you see. And I was able to use the power to restore this pure heart. I know not how you found it, but this pure heart shows that fate is on your side. Take good care of it. And by the way, it may please you to know that your game is not truly over. Somehow, you were sent to the underwear while still very much alive. My power can return you to your world if you so wish. What would you like to do? We'll return. Then I shall return you. Jadies, mm -hmm. Jadies, Jadies, Jadies! Ooh, game over, game over, game over, game over, game over, game over, game over! Continue! Is this what happens every time you get a game over screen in a Mario game? JD's is just game over, game over, game over, continue! Oh shit! We're back in flip side! Mario! You're alive! M -m 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 Mario? But I saw Dementio in your game! Then Tippy said you were here, so I thought I'd come take a look, but. Wow, you're truly alive. You know, my bro always bounces back. Like me, I bounce too. Um, and you are... We can introduce ourselves later. For now, let's head to my house. So that's how you did it, then. <laughs> Hi. Hi. So hey, I'm Luigi. I'm my bro's bro. Nice to meet you. Haven't we met somewhere before? Hmm. Oh boy, not that I can remember, but... Wait, is it possible that you're our fourth hero? Funny you should say that, I just found this interesting bit in the Light Prognosticus. The seventh lost pure heart will draw together two men, and when the light returns, its brilliance sh will show the way to the last hero. Yes, as Tippy said, I think this fellow in green may be our final hero. Mario, I've never stopped believing you would return. But Princess Peach and Bowser... How to proceed? Well, if you could come back, perhaps Peach and Bowser also can. But first, let's find a heart pillar where we can set this heart pure heart. And I think... Actually... Yeah, we'll, we'll do that in this episode. We have to head on over to Flopside, so I will meet you guys over there, and once we're at uh, Nolrum's house, we will see where to head from there. See you guys in a second. Alrighty, we're back in Flopside. Let me save real quick. And now, let's head off to find that pure heart. It should be over here somewhere, I think. I wonder if there's anything in this direction. Yes? Hello, Pharaoh. 
Oh. Wait, can you make it appear? That's a heart floating in the air. It looks like the pure heart, but what is it? Hello, it's clearly a fucking pure heart pillar. But I guess we're not supposed to be at that one yet. Well, at least we know where the last one is. Hi. Don't say hi back or anything, jeez. Do 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 do. Um. All right, we gotta take this. He brush he head. Should be right over here. Oh, we gotta use Kudge again. But wait. <gasps> okay, Logie, it's your turn, dude. <laughs> Next world, baby! We got two more worlds, I'm so excited! I was gonna try to record it all tonight, but I'm feeling really, really tired. But I recorded like five episodes, I think? Quite a bit. purple door. Oh, it looks so nice. So this is the seventh. Now there's just a single pure heart left to find. We have to act quickly. We have to stop that bloomy air. Ooh! Oh shit! Hmm? What did I just... Bloomy air? Wait, hold on. Who in the world is that? I... What am I saying? <laughs> Ooh, shit's picking up, boys! I love it! Oh, I almost don't want to stop playing. Oh, fuck. Wait, where are we? I- Oh, what the fuck? What is this? Ooh! I'll take a bite out of that. Why are you licking your toes? Ooh, a berry card. Hey, we have a berry pixel. You know what? You know what? I'm hungry, but we're gonna continue playing just for a little bit. Come on, Tippy. You had to say something. You had to make me invested again. Oh, ho, ho. oh do I need medio? Well, actually. Maybe before I continue on, I will eat something because I am rather hangry. Oh shit. Does this take us to the pit of a hundred trials? Oh! Who are you? Oh. Uh, yeah. I appreciate this. Very much so. What is my attack? Oh, 7 and 14? Damn! Alright, well... Let's use this. Let's use this. And head back to flip side. I was gonna say we'll heal up, but um, it shouldn't be a problem. Oh my god, the fucking void is huge. Dementio's savage attack had separated Mario from his friends. He had reunited with Luigi, yes, but Peach and Bowser were still missing. Just where were those two? And what new dangers lay ahead? It was time to venture through the door opened by the seventh pure heart. Once again, Mario saw a nightmarish landscape beyond imagination. Chapter 7-1 Subterranean Vacation Familiar? We're back in the underwear! <laughs> Fuck. 
funny. Funny. Don't bite me. It's so dark here. I wonder what sort of world this is. Mario, what's wrong? Oh, you want to leave? Hang on. Huh? Oh, so this is... This would be the underwear place that you mentioned earlier. Hmm. Then I wonder why the pure heart led us here. Alright, guys. In the next episode, we will venture on through the underwear and see if we can find Peach and Bowser. Anyways, I'll see you guys in the next episode. Thank you so much for watching. Bye-bye!